Hi everyone, this is Miss Miharo. Today I'm going to talk a bit about the combos I do as collector and why I do them. So you might have seen I prefer doing the grounded combo, this one. Uh, that nets you 20% um, if your um, uh, if you start with forward one, it nets you 25 if you start with one one three. Uh, so you can mix this up by going for a jump kick. Here you can get 29-30%, uh, which is max damage. Uh, or you can go for the sickle, right? And you get 29%. So there's like a 2% difference at most. I just don't think that's big enough to warrant the downsides. So what are the downsides you say? Um, first of all, you can get full combo punished. This one is the easier one to punish. Let's see if I can... There we go. Full combo punish. Uh, if you go for the grab ender, that's a bit harder to punish. Let's see if I can make it work. The trick is to break away, you can see there, you get a punish. And even if they don't get the punish, I don't like the idea of being super minus and them being able to enforce, enforce their mix up because I force them to break away, right? Um, so that's the main reason you lose like not even a significant amount of damage. Uh, in the corner, I, I could argue that um, you get more damage because you get the jump in. Oops. Uh, you get the jump in kick. Down two, down two. And into whatever. You've seen my videos on the different combo enders. Uh, and the d damage uh, difference is quite significant. So there, I would say it's worth it at times if you want them if they don't have a bar to break away or if you don't uh, or if you don't care if they break away, right? But generally um, I I would say go for the grounded combo. There's the second reason and this one I think is the biggest reason. So say we put you on Sandstorm, right? The sickle gives you really good oki and I prefer the oki, oki from the sickle to the one from the command grab. It's really preference, but I, I just prefer it. It leaves you a bit closer. So the thing is, you have the back one uh, setup, which I've shown in previous videos. You can do back one into Bola and get a punish, full combo punish against a lot of characters. Works on a lot of up twos and up threes. Uh, you can also, if you want to stay a bit safer, do this. Oops. Which will punish them, send them away for 14% meterless. Uh, it's kind of cool. Uh, you can also do things like back three. As you can see, I hit him. Uh, you can also do like back three ugh, back three bola which works in some other wake ups and you get the full combo pew 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 um and that's pretty good as well i really like his different options on oki so i don't mind them having the bar because i can always make a read and if i make the read i usually end up the better but I'd, I'd say the main reason uh, for you to want to go for this is to fish for the crushing blow, right? So you get this grab crushing blow if they try to roll. So you can dash up and grab them and you will grab them out of the roll. You can go for a pretty easy combo for 33%. And they will never be able to break that since they've just rolled, right? Uh, you can also go for a bigger combo. which I dropped. And you get about 
You can even use the second bar if you wanted to get like, for, like 42. But the point is, you really want to fish for this crushing blow. And since they've just rolled, they'll never be able to break it. Which makes it a lot of fun. A lot of fun. Actually, you can side switch with this as well and you get almost the same damage. So you get forward 2 2. Side switch 33%. Uh, it's not the best Oki, but if you get in the corner or something, it could be worth it. Um, so yeah, that's why I prefer going for the jump in one, uh, forward four into sickle. I know you can do like very late jump in two, but it's just not, it's not consistent enough for me to really be bothered by it. It's such a small difference in damage. Uh, so I don't think it's really worth if you're super consistent with it go for it but I'm not so I'm not gonna do it but yeah that's it for this video and how I think about uh, collectors combos and why I use the grounded ones so thank you so much for watching if you like this or if you have better suggestions please leave them in the comments and see you next time